Verse number four. Toastmaster Shani T. There was a cat that really was gone. Run, run, of the team, lower of the reaching king. There was a cat that really was gone. I was sitting back, relaxing, and enjoyed the Rasputin song from Bonium Band, back to my seventh standard excursion trip. The bus about to start, all we were engaged in fun games, shared the snacks, and cheered with the songs and dances. I was even more excited and more happy because I found my favorite dream girl was sitting alone back in that bus. And I decided to say my first word of love in that moment. I hold her rose with me and moved closer to her. Closer and closer. I looked at her eyes. She stared at me in a strange way to top to bottom. And I felt my heart beat fasting. Butterflies in my stomach many times. But I built up my courage and confidence. Finally, finally, right in front of her, I said, Shabna, I Lol. lost my mathematics equation books last day. If you found it, please let me know. Thank you. I rushed to back to the corner seat in the bus and released my stress. Corner chair, dear Toastmasters, let's go to my school days. I was pretty sure nobody found my attempt in that bus. But, shy. You have to leave this bus right now and follow the other queue outside to get the next bus, said by our mathematics teacher Solomon. I was astonished because all kids were looking at me and I didn't do any mistakes to get eliminated from the first bus. I was sad and confused. I didn't like mathematics subject in upper primary class. But all students, we loved our mathematics teacher Solomon. One day he told, Dear students, please bring some plants from your home tomorrow. The next day, we brought different types of plants from home. And we made different sizes and shapes of gardens like triangle, rectangle, circular, and oval shapes. Later onwards, teacher Solomon started to teach the mathematical equations based on these garden sizes, levels, and shapes. Such an easy way he made to understanding us. Time passed by. Some days earlier to our annual examination, teacher Solomon said, Dear students, try to bring extra tiffin box and also good-looking used clothes from your home. Back at my home, I told my mother. She was so happy to prepare special dishes for this special tiffin. And let me. I packed my favorite striped t shirt and blue trouser in that box and put together a pack well, put on my name, and kept Teacher Solomon office. Exam was over. All we were passed that seventh standard. Before getting admission in the eighth standard far away school from our village, there was one send-off party. Send-off party was going on. Headmistress called Solomon teacher to address the speech. He said, My loving students, I respect you all. Thank you very much for your contributions, your food, your dresses, everything. You know my lovely kids. I gave this food to some students in our school. They had mostly starving from previous nights during the examination time. And I provided the clothes 
to some students from slums area, literally the students not getting any support from their parents. He wished all of us bright future and good luck. Whenever his speech was over, I was about to leave the hall. Then I noticed somebody tapping my shoulder. I looked back and I saw teacher Solomon there, smiled and said, Sharit, I know you hurt in that discussion purse. I am, a, I am very sorry about that. But if you travel in the first bus, you might happen to see a boy sitting in the middle row with your striped t-shirt. And if you happen to say this, some kids, your friends, it will make a big painful scar in his life. Because Shani, this boy is a parent's abandoned boy. And also he added, I know very well the real value of a cloth and also a deep hunger for food because I grew up in an orphanage. Good luck, Shanik, study well. When he was moving away, I was looking behind him and I thought our world would become much more better if we love and recognize and realize the people in a deep way. Teacher Solomon transformed the mathematics equations to a better value builder. I believe, I strongly believe, we the Toastmasters have many formulas to influence and empower our community to a better value builder. Get this rose, go and impact the world with your inspiration and your leadership because you and me send this world for a specific purpose. Contest chair.